our rare coastal farm belt, 22,000 acres in western Boca, Delray, and Boynton Beach, is called the Agricultural Reserve. Citizens voted in 1999 to spend $100 million to buy land in the reserve. Our master plan established guidelines for developing there to preserve the area's rural culture in perpetuity. But over the years, county commissioners have let developers build thousands of homes and many commercial sites. If you come out west of 441, all of this farm country is all growing the vegetables. The Bedners are a very famous family that have their farm stand just south of here. It's farm fresh stuff that's just absolutely wonderful and I, I hope we can preserve that. Yes, we want to maintain the protected status and not change the rules. The trails, which are right here, are actually the preserve area. and You're riding in the Everglades. So my wife and I, Barbara, I had a dream to create a sanctuary for horses. We came to the Ag Reserve for the open space and the promise from the county that the land would be protected from development. I get approached by developers all the time and they want this property, they want what's next to me, so we've talked among ourselves along the road here and we're really not interested in, in selling. 20 years ago, Palm Beach County said they'd never Browardize, is what it was called, Browardization. And it's, that's what they're doing until they've got million dollar homes butted up against the preserve and the Everglades. The estimate, according to the Palm Beach Post, is that GL will make a half a billion, not million, billion dollars more. Unfortunately, our commission has not taken the approach they have in other parts of the country and have been firm with developers in telling them this is protected land. Let me tell you, they're powerful, they have a lot of money, and I think they can have political influence based on how much money they have. The important part of the Ag Reserve is its ability to provide water into our aquifers when it rains. At the same time, during heavy rains, the Ag Reserve captures rainwater so there's less risk of flooding to homeowners. With climate change, we will see more heavy rain events and potentially more droughts. Without the Ag Reserve, the county will not be able to handle these events. In late August, county commissioners will vote on several huge development projects requiring new zoning, a disaster for the Ag Reserve. You can stop these changes. Call or email your commissioner right now. Tell them enough is enough. So let's go and get vocal on social media, talk to your commissioners, tell them how important it is that we want to preserve this and not let it go because it's, it's, very, it's a very unique ecosystem and agriculture is important to us all. Learn more about commissioners' contact information by clicking the link below.